Today, what changes do you see from the Eurovision Song Contest? Oh, a little bit more of the dressing, the, what people are wearing. And uh, there are more I, emphasis I, on, on, on that. Uh, it was, the, the emphasis was more on the songs at that time. But uh, that's how it develops and uh, we see no problem in that. A lot of journalists said that there is a positive shock from the qualifiers uh, that uh, made it to the final this year. No Turkey, no Armenia who got used to being in the final. How do you see in this perspective? Well, of course we're sorry that we can't be there anyone. We would like everybody to win, but uh, we can't. And, but I just think that it's very English. important that all countries who wants to be a part of Europe is in this contest. Because we believe that Europe has to be together. So I just think that just participating, you might not win, but your participating is very good. I mean, it's a very peaceful day, uh, uh, that day, you know. Uh, there's peace in Europe uh, for, music. for five, yeah, yeah, for for five hours. And I mean, who won't have peace mm. for five yeah. hours? Yes. Yes. And, uh, uh, um, I would love it. Yes. In 2000, uh, our website, ESU Today, was created in the same year you won the Eurovision Song Contest and special message by awesome brothers to esctoday.com readers. Okay. Yeah, see you. <laughs> Do you want me to, what did you say at last? And a special message to esctoday.com. Uh, yes, what a special message. We love the Eurovision and uh, we hope that it'll make uh, Europe a better place for all of us to live in. Thank Pe you. Peace and love. Fly on the wings of love Fly baby fly Reaching the stars above, touching the sky. Wow! Great year to smile. Yep, yep, thank you.